What's up, YouTubers? This is Dom Carini doing my review of the X-Men 97 Marvel Legends Jean Grey. Yes, this figure I ordered on eBay. So before we get into this review of this figure in this video, I want to apologize to all of you. I'm sorry I couldn't even make any videos because I've been struggling with my with work, money, and time, stuff like that, because somehow it's, my life's pretty crazy, you know, but I'm sorry. But anyway, um, as you all know that my other the day ago, that okay, so uh, how many days was it? Um, if you guys missed out on my birthday on March 29th, just leave a comment down below and wish me a happy belated birthday, something like that, because I'm 32 years old. So, anyway, thank you all. So, I'm back. So, here we have Jean Grey from X-Men 97. If you guys watch the show X-Men 97 on Disney Plus streaming on Wednesday by tomorrow, let me know if you guys like it. And I pretty much liked it. And here we have Jean Grey right here. And we have other figures. We have this cool artwork of Jean Grey. Here we have Magneto, Wolverine, Storm. Gambit, Bishop, and Rogue. And on the back, we have the cool figure right there. We have other figures, including the Magneto, Cyclops, which I have. Nightcrawler, have him. And we have Jean Grey, which we're doing now. Executioner, which I'll get him. And Goblin Queen, which I'll get her. And I'll get Magneto and Executioner when I get a chance. So, anyway, let's get this figure out of the package. And here we have Jean Grey outside of the package. Let's take a closer look at this figure. So, I'm loving how they did a nice detail of her face. Her face looks very, very good. And it looks very cartoony alike. And it looks beautiful, absolutely. And they gave her blue eyes instead of green. But in the comic books, they said that she has green eyes. But, but who cares? It's just a cartoon, so so what? So let's get a close zoom on her eyes, and if I get my camera to... Okay, yep, it did focus. And it looks pretty good. And I love how the paint work did a very good job with this. And it's pretty good so far. Yeah. Yeah. But we'll get to the comparisons in no time. So, so accessory she comes with is she has like one close fist and one pair of relaxed hands so she can use her telepathic power and a head sculpt with her, her hair undone, like loose, but she has a ponytail and she has two open palm hands. So all you do is just like remove this one out and she just, it can fit right nice and tight, just like so, just like that. And you can just pop this head out. And pop this one in. And again, it can fit right nice and tight. If I could just... Oh, wait. Wait a minute. Okay. Yep. I got it on. Yep. Good. And yeah. That's... that's Yeah. Okay. Um, and anyway, uh, let's do a comparison with this X-Men 97 Jean Grey and the rest of the Marvel Legend. X-Men figures. Here's a comparison with the X-Men 97 Jean Grey standing next to alongside the X-Men 97 Cyclops, the VHS package of Wolverine, X-Men 97 Storm, and Astonishing X-Men Emma Frost. As you can see, she's pretty much shorter than um, the, the gentleman right there, and she's pretty much in the same height as the, the women. Here we have the VHS style Cell shading Jean Grey, Cyclops, Storm, and Dark Phoenix. Here we have Rogue, Gambit, Jubilee, and Beast. Here we have Nightcrawler, Bishop, Professor X, and Morph, Colossus, Magneto, Mystique, Toad, and Avalanche, Scarlet Witch, Quicksilver, and Mr. Sinister. And our final comparison, Apocalypse, Juggernaut, and Blob. Okay, going over free articulation, 
is her head can look up that much, can look down, can pivot from side to side, go all the way around 360. And her ponytail can remove, so it can be annoying. So you can actually give it a rotation. Like, you can have it, oh, shit. I mean, <laughs> I mean, you can have it, like, blowing in the wind, like so. Yeah, you can have it just like this or that, whichever you prefer. And her arms do go in and out, can go all the way around 360 and her shoulder pads are are attached to the mm, yeah okay arms do go in and out can oh yeah i did that we have a bicep swivel we have double jointed elbows which we finally have double jointed elbow fully articulated jean gray which are, damn it you know what okay fine we have wrist hinge and a swivel we also don't have a diaphragm joint. We do have it right there. We have a waist swivel, like so. Let's kick forward. Can kick back and do the splits. And also we have a thigh cut swivel. We have double jointed, double jointed knee, double jointed knees, which I can't possibly. Yep. Yeah, okay. We have feet hinge, and of course the ankle pivots. Okay, that about wraps up my reveal. So for my final thought for this figure, I absolutely love it. And I, of course, I dig it a lot. And so I am pretty happy that they gave her a uh, double jointed elbow so she can place her hand like for her side of her head, like she can use her telepathic powers. And so uh, for the VHS um, retro release of Jean Grey in the VHS style packaging, because it, they gave her like single jointed elbow. It was just not fair. So I'm pretty happy about this. So overall, it's awesome. And I love how they gave her a new look of her face sculpt and the different shade color of her hair looking really ruby red. So anyway, if you guys like this video, give me a video a thumbs up, leave a comment down below what you think. Subscribe to my channel, think about everything I upload and also follow me on Instagram. And also share this video to your friends and family. And of course, please, everybody, give me all the like for this video and subscribe to my channel. So thanks for watching, everybody, and take care. Have an excellent day.